What's going on YouTube? It is Greg Luck Fitness. It feels so long since I've done that intro, that is really weird. Normally it's me starting a video close up on a bowl of porridge oats or something, but today it's going to be close up on a coffee. So you see those two empty bottles there? Yesterday, me and the man himself sat, who came down, as you see, in the Nando's. We ended up drinking like idiots. I don't really see the point in drinking, but oh well, YOLO. Once in a while, you know, it's not really going to hurt anyone. And to be fair, I don't really feel any effects this morning, like no hangover or anything. I woke up at half seven, something like that, and it's currently ten o'clock. I had full English breakfast. I would have recorded it, but I didn't have my camera with me. But we've got to hit shoulders and triceps today. And to be fair, I don't even know if I'm going to lift heavy today because my joints, and my wrists, and like, even off squatting, holding the bar there, it curls. But yeah, I still haven't even edited or uploaded anything. Uh, to do with the leg and bicep phase 5 so I have to get that up before this so it's going to be another double upload day it's got to be done hasn't it guys it's got to be done so guys we are going to drink that coffee um, probably eat something or, I don't know but you're coming with me you're coming with me so let's go only one in the gym guys Whoa. All right, time to hit some shoulders, man. Let's see how we're feeling today. Hello, hello, hello. Back with another saucy voiceover. It is currently, it is currently 20 minutes to two. So as I said at the start of this, not really going to lift heavy and literally I hardly even trained. But the fact is I got into the gym and I still targeted the area in some what I did more than two exercises on each um, body part which was shoulders and triceps so I'm just blasting the 30s at the moment I managed to get a set of 15 then I think I got like a set of 7 because my wrists were playing up and then I got a seven of eight, a set of 8 and a set of 10 or something it's all um, in the screenshot anyway on my phone which I will be showing at, probably at the end of phase 6 to show all the progress but I do want to get a nice strong shoulder session in so after this I moved into a standing barbell press just to try and get some more pressing movements. I'm actually not coming onto my tiptoes as it looks like I am for some reason there. I'm just soft on my knees. Just don't want any more joint problems, especially in my knees, man. I want to keep progressing my squat and deadlift, but I just used 30 kilograms there and got 10 reps. All right, moving on to side laterals. This is actually really heavy. Uh, you can see how, much, how heavy it is due to the contraction in my tricep. See, that's what I mean. I squeeze the handles really hard and in in time, that will benefit me more as my grip strength will be extremely strong. But at the moment, like it's giving me pains and that. But the plan is hard, man. We did nine kilograms on the big cables on this side. Then that was shoulders done. I was happy with that. I actually got some shoulder work done. So into triceps and again, joints are a bit achy, especially the elbows off all the curls. Uh, it's actually feeling better now, though. But yeah, we just did rope extensions and then straight bar push down. And that was it. So hopefully tomorrow it'll be really good. Back and biceps. I'm going to be using the massaging thing like I'm going to mention in the next clip. And it'll all be Gucci. Join you in tomorrow's video, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. Thumbs it up. Peace. What's going on, guys? We just got back. Apologies for not following a plan in this video. But, you know, I'm knackered just like through lack of sleep. And my joints need to repair. So, you know, can only get better. Tomorrow is phase six back and biceps and I'm gonna rest up, man. Maybe I might use this massaging thing that I've got that I was kindly bought. So it's electric and you can like hold it on the muscles and that. Give that a try and like, try and help the biceps that's knackered as well from legs and biceps yesterday, which I need to edit and upload. So it is a hard plan and when you get to the sixth phase, it's obviously gonna be hard. First off, half a litre of almond milk. I like the unsweetened one and it's currently one pound in Sainsbury's. So we just smash that into the blender. Then next up, two scoops of whey protein, four bananas. I do normally like the bigger size bananas than this, but well, these two aren't bad, but these two are tiny. But yeah, four big bananas if you can get four big ones. Same for us at the moment, ah, oh, slacking. Okay, moving on to this beast. So this is a spoon that I use, and I put two big spoons in of this. I'm not sure on the exact measurement, but do you want to try and get the best peanut butter and this is really good because it's got no palm oil in so yeah it's, it's much more healthy for you and it's going to make you them games once you've got all the ingredients together it should look a little bit like this bang the lid on <laughs> if 
Finally guys, you want to add a bit of desiccated coconut on the top. It's kind of high in fat, but it is natural and obviously if it's high in fat, the calories are going to be high as well. But I am smashing all the calories in and that's the whole idea of the shake. Thanks a lot for watching guys, it has been Greg Lock Fitness.